Lady of Montserrat, the Roman Catholic Church that's located in the hills of Tortuga in central Trinidad. It's a beautiful wooden church in a typical tropical architecture design. The church was built in 1878 by Marie-Jules de Pou, who was a French priest and architect. He was our first shepherd. The church is where everybody gets together. The church is, is where people learn to work with one another. Most of the churches were built through community activism to start with. It's the people who live in the area, it's their great-grandparents who toted the mud, the bricks, the sand, who mixed the lime, who cut down the trees. It's their ancestors who built the church. So it's like taking care of your grandmother or anybody. It's the respect for the ancestors. In 1999, there was conversation among the parishioners and the ancestors of the Cocoa Estates to set up a restoration committee. At the time, the church was really in a very depressed state. Long jebnests hanging from the ceilings, holes in the floor, holes in the wall, was in a terrible state of dilapidation. The church is a good example of proper restoration work. Nothing was done to detract from the historic detailing. The cross ventilation in that church is still there. If you go, you will see the windows on the two sides of the church have fixed louvers at the bottom, and that goes all the way around, so that even when the window is closed, there's air passing through the church. Our Lady of Montserrat is a very peaceful and beautiful place. The beauty is both outside and inside. Outside, you have this panoramic view of the Gulf of Paria, as far south you could see as La Brea, sometimes Point Forte, as far north as off the islands and the northwestern peninsula. And on a clear day, across the Gulf, you can see Venezuela. I'm barely the section of the church. I take over from my uncle. Well, normally he used to ring the bell and lock up and thing, but he's pretty old now, so I take over the job of being in the church. Our Lady of Montserrat is my heavenly mother. The amount of things that she has done for me is just beautiful. It's such a beautiful space and Our Lady is so present and palpable in the church. The idea of this church really is not about Catholicism only. We want people to know that whatever race, color, creed they are, wherever they are in the world, she is waiting for them to love.